Hey guys, so today I wanted to film a video in a different setting because like this is like a kitchen theme video but my dad's watching TV in the living room so I kind of can't. But this is still kitchen themed so you know, going with it. So I want to combine the two things that will help a teenage girl or an adult woman survive out in the big world. Food, makeup. I wanted to combine them. So today I'm going to try to make food into makeup and we're going to see how this goes. I've already seen like when we did the full face, when that was a trend, like full face and makeup, like I saw the Gabby show do this, but my stuff is not based off of her stuff. Like she did like food, like spray or whatever. I don't have any of that stuff. I'm using chocolate for something, cheese puffs for something and pudding for something, and the rest of it I'll improvise. So first, let's start with the eyeballs, or should we start with the rest of the face? I think I'm gonna start with the eyes first because I don't know how long I can tolerate pudding on my face. So, you know, we're gonna figure this out. Um, yeah, so here we go. Should I take you to a different setting where you can see my face better? Maybe, okay, moving. E better? Not better. Bad angle. Okay. <laughs> I like when you try something and you're like, hey, that's not going to work out. Moving to the other corner of my room. Do you see my guard bag? There's a lovely Olaf bag over there. My room. Oh, and yes, this is a Christmas calendar. It never got taken down. Ever. Don't know why. It's just, you know, something that's there. <laughs> okay, I'm back. And I'm back. Guess who's back? Back, back, back again. Again, again. Okay, never mind. Can't get copyrighted. I do not own. I do not own any of that song, like whatsoever. I don't own Olaf either, but like. Trying to fix you people. There you go. Angle. Down a bit. There you go. Hello, I'm here. So, we're going to start with the eyes. So, my mirror's here. So, I might turn around. For the eyes, I'm going to use chocolate as eyeliner. We're going to see how this works. So, it's already kind of melty. So, we're going to try this out. I'm going to turn around and use the mirror. And then I'll turn around when this is done. Wow. For chocolate, that's not that bad. I did one wing. I mean, it's chocolate, so it's not great. But, like, if you're going for a thick wing, that's not that bad. And that's chocolate. Okay. Going to the other side. Okay. That's not that bad. Am I just crazy or is that, that not that bad? I think I'm going a little bit crazy. I mean, it's everywhere. Like, it's clumping. But the wing, though, this wing looks better. But, like, it doesn't look that bad. I'm impressed. For chocolate, yes, I'm impressed. Okay, so the wing's good. Now we need eyeshadow. And for eyeshadow, I'm kind of improvising because I didn't think of any other food options because those are the pigmented things I thought of. So I think I'm going to try to use... 
Hmm. Gotta think now. I was gonna do something like sprinkles or something like that, but I don't know if I can go get my sprinkles. So, you know. Dee 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 dee. I look like I have no arms. Hello. I have no arms. Eh, arm. Arm. Okay. I think I'm just gonna use... Should I have orange eyeshadow? Because then I can use the cheese puffs for that. I think I'm just gonna use the chocolate again for my eyeshadow. Yeah. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that's horrible and terrible, and I think I'm gonna take that off. I mean, if you're going for a brown, it's definitely pigmented. This looks terrible, but it wasn't supposed to get, look good, since I'm gonna do my eyebrows with it too, so you know. I. Okay. Besides the color not working out, that's not that bad. This is the set I did chocolate on. <sighs> that's not that bad for like eyebrows though. I never, I've never done my eyebrow eyebrows. I'm not even gonna lie. Never plucked them. Never done them. So you know, I don't really know. This is turning out to be full face with chocolate. <laughs> I don't like it. Anyway. Like, the color matches not at all. Like, it matches in my eyebrows. It melted in my hand. It's chocolate. It's great. Ready for the rest of it? It's gonna make you cringe even more than this video. We have cheese puffs. Now I'm gonna use cheese puffs as bronzer. We're gonna see how this works. I have a cheese puff. Rub it on my face. All over my face. Let's see how this works. I'm gonna take a more pigmented Cheeto. That one's got a lot of dust on it. Okay. Do you see what it did to my cheeks? Like, zoom in though. Like, just cheese dust, like everywhere. Long enough, I guess. These clips come in handy with like chips. That's why I meet in my family we call them chip, chip clips. Honestly, from far away, I don't look too bad. Like, I'm pretty sure that's all in my head. Like, I probably look like a straight up idiot right now. Also, being that I can't roll this up. But voila. Savor your chips, your items. Now for the pudding. No, this is not a good idea, children. Don't do this. This is tapioca pudding. I'm gonna take one finger. This is totally my skin tone. Use less of a glob, put some back. <laughs> We're gonna use this as foundation and concealer. And I know bronzer goes on after this, but it wouldn't stick, so I'm doing concealer. This is great. Okay, so I'm smearing the pudding on my face. Do you see this? I haven't done my forehead yet. 
pudding. I think we need some more. My face smells like food. <laughs> this feels great. Don't do this, children. Like, highly recommend to not do this. Uh, I need to look in the mirror, because, like, looking at the camera is not working. But just proof that I'm doing it. And the beads. Okay. There. You can tell though that's my actual skin tone. Like tapioca pudding skin tone. Like that's scary and sad. But it's my skin, so you know. So, I think that's the end of this video. Click the link below and click the like button because um, I just got tortured by food. But of course it was my idea, so you know. Bye guys.